I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Cindy Walker, hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you today? I'm fine. Thank you so much for joining me in my audience as I broadcast live from Dallas, Texas, and I'm getting ready to talk to Cindy Walker. She's my next guest, and we're going to talk about the Epic Gaming lineup coming to Xbox. All right, Cindy, I'm really excited. So how do we stay in the game? Well, you stay in the game by joining Xbox Game Pass, because what we just showed on Sunday was uh, what the Xbox and Bethesda Games Showcase was 30 titles uh, that ranged from massive blockbusters coming this holiday to, you know, games coming in a year or two to indie darlings that are showing up soon. But 27 of the 30 are all coming as a part of our Xbox Game Pass membership, where you can play over 100 titles on PC, console, uh, and on your mobile device. Uh, it offers you the opportunity to play some previously released titles from third-party partners and first-party games, as well as brand new Xbox Game Studios games the day that they launch. So we felt like we the, the show really landed some amazing new games coming this holiday and uh, most of them coming into Xbox Game Pass. You know, Xbox has been around a long time. I don't know how long, but what keeps it so years. popular? Yeah, the, we've been around for 20 years. This year is our anniversary uh, alongside Halo. And, you know, what makes most gaming, uh, you know, platforms really popular are the games. And I think we are in a better position than we've ever been before. We have 23 game studios producing first party titles for Xbox platforms. That's, again, console, PC, and to play in the cloud on your mobile device. Uh, and then we've kind of tried to evolve our business model a little bit. So it's not just about, you know, paying for games outright or buying consoles outright even. We've got a couple of, of membership services that allow people to kind of join Xbox, how they might be felt more comfortable. So for instance, we also have a program called Xbox All Access, where you can get two years of Xbox Game Pass, as well as your console of choice, either Xbox Series X or S, and you just pay a low monthly fee, sort of like you do for your cell phone. It allows more people to kind of get into gaming. Do you have like uh, Xbox championships? And forgive me, because I don't know this answer to this question, like Xbox championship or the best Xbox Xbox game player or something like that to keep younger people involved? Are you talking about like maybe esports, like uh, tournaments and things like that? Yeah, you got it. We don't have anything that's at Xbox level. Most of those tournaments happen at the franchise level. So Halo has esports, uh, Forza has some esports tournaments that go on. You know, many of the other are the third party partners like Fortnite, they do a lot of, uh, of tournaments. It does get some of the younger folks involved. Although typically I would say that that really what, what we found for really net new people in, that are just getting into gaming, particularly console gaming, uh, one of the best ways to do that is with our new next gen console, which is the Series S which is the lowest price next gen console it's also the smallest format it's very small and it fits kind of right into your lifestyle when you add that to an xbox game pass subscription you're able to get a hold of hundreds of titles playable digitally on this great little box uh it really allows a lot of great um discoverability and it doesn't require a whole lot of of you know kind of money output right away for somebody who's brand new Okay, but I wanted to say that because I've got I go over people houses and they have these Xbox tournaments at their home. I'm and they're so serious about it. They're so serious, so focused, so energetic and I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah. Yep. Gaming has definitely had a nice resurgence over the last several years and last year more than ever it really showcased how 
you know, playing an interactive, uh, you know, form of entertainment like gaming, being able to socially connect with people, even when you can't actually connect with people in person. Uh, gaming is a really unique way to stay entertained and connect with your friends and family. So we've had a really interesting uh, last 18 months in the gaming industry that we're looking forward to hopefully kind of continuing that momentum moving forward. All right. And people want to get more Xbox or more Xbox information. Where do you send them? Please head on over to xbox.com to learn more on how you can start gaming with us. Cindy Walker, thank you so much for stopping by the Valder BB show and talking about Xbox. Hi, I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB show broadcast on radio and television. And this is my phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands free, pocket free, purse free, even belt free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.